What's going on guys? Connor owns fast food here back with a brand new video. This is Q&A Monday episode 4. This is my favorite place to work. Brings me a ton of money. Let's get rolling with those Mick questions. The first question is by Zach Cottrell. Was McDonald's your first choice or, or did you have any other choices other than McDonald's? McDonald's was my first choice. My second choice would have been Dairy Queen because it's right by my house or Subway. And I'm really happy that I got the job because I love it. It's an easy job, good pay, friendly people. It's just a good job overall. This is the third question by Peter. Do you like dank memes? I know what you mean, but like, I guess you gotta give me an example. Your boy Indica says, I got a GameCube I don't use. One I'm actually working on getting a P.O. box set up so you guys could send me stuff because I don't want to send you guys my current address because I find it kind of creepy that you guys wouldn't know where I live. So I'm working on opening up a P.O. box. Then you guys will see my stuff on eBay. I'll be able to sell cool shirts like this. Exus5000 says, I have a GameCube, LOL. I don't want it. Do you want it? LOL. I, I do want it, but as I said before, I'm going to get a P.O. box set up so you guys could send me cool stuff. Boss Nega Allen said, can I ask a question for Q&A Monday here? Yes, you can. Shady Massawi, are you planning to study something in the future or go to some college? Go to some college. Um, no, I'm not gonna go to college. Jamie Mellon has a very confusing question. What are the meat of all fast food stores made of, and what is the worst? Um, I personally do not know what anything is made of because I don't work at the factories. I'm guessing that it's all real meat, but then it gets processed and added other stuff to make it fake. So it's real, but fake. Stephen McMillan says, would you do a video on Chick-fil-A if there's one in your area? And yes, they just opened up a Chick-fil-A in Deerfield, which is like a few cities over it's only like four and a half five miles away so I will be going to Chick-fil-a very soon and making a video for you guys outstanding ramen says what's your, I like that name what's your favorite dessert item on the McDonald's menu I have three favorite dessert menu items at McDonald's it's probably the parfait the McFlurry and the caramel sundae I love all three of them but if I had to knock them all down I'd say the caramel sundae would be the best thing at McDonald's for a dessert Christian Barrow says what was your SAT score uh I think I think I got, uh, 1350, which is really bad. So I never got a chance to make the selfie giveaway for you guys, and I apologize greatly for that. I'm gonna show you guys some of the pictures I received on Instagram and on Kick, and just wanted to thank all of you guys, all my mix drivers so much for participating in the giveaway. And I don't like it. I love it, love it, love it. Uh oh. So good it hurts. I don't want it. I gotta, gotta have it. Uh oh. I can't find the words, I just go. The last question is by a friend on Kick named FLG Deads, and he asked me why did I originally start making YouTube videos, and I've answered this plenty of times. Maybe he's just a new McScriber. The reason why I started making videos about McDonald's on YouTube and my McDonald's employee series was because all of my friends on Xbox, I would tell them all these funny stories, blah blah blah, about what it's like working at McDonald's. And so many people would ask me what it's like working at McDonald's, so finally I was just like, fine guys, make one video, what it's like working at McDonald's. And that video on YouTube pretty much skyrocketed to like 500 views. I had like maybe 10 subscribers and those 500 views inspired me to keep on making more and more McDonald's employee videos and now we are here and I still work at McDonald's. I work at McDonald's two days a week, six hours a day. It's not much. I just work there overnight. I'm kind of upset because they did close the inside of our McDonald's so there's no longer people coming inside and saying hello but there are people on drive through when I take an order. Some of my friends already recognize my voice. They're like, yo, what's up, Connor? I'm like, yo! The Mick community is so amazing. I love all of my customers. I love all of my workers. Once in a while, there's gonna be one guy that's a complete asshole to you while working at McDonald's. <laughs> Make sure you guys leave your comments down below for any questions you guys have about fast food, my personal life, anything you guys want to know, I'll answer it down in the comment section below. I just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you guys become a subscriber. McDonald's Gang Sign created in episode 3 on top of the McDonald's food tray. Make sure you guys become a subscriber. Slap that thumbs up button. Have a nice day. Peace out, guys. Bye-bye. Erectile dysfunction is bad, but leaving a like on the video isn't. Whether you're hard or soft, make sure to slap that like button and subscribe while you're at it.